That's very Kristen of you. Pillow talk. Today, what we're talking about is things that lesbians are obsessed with. I'm wearing what I'm obsessed with today. Clothing. Adriana loves to shop. Oh my god, it's my favorite thing <laughs> to do. So this video is actually sponsored by uh, Best Fiends. And I feel like I'm very obsessed with games on my phone. Probably because sometimes I get mass anxiety and I just don't want to talk to anyone. <laughs> so I'm just like, I'm going to go over here and just play my game. Or if you're like on a subway and you're like, I'm going to play my game. Or you're bored. You are constantly I'm playing cell phone games. I don't have a lot going on in my life. This game, Best Fiends, is uh, a puzzle, like, adventure game where you, mm -hmm. like, have to connect, like, colors and shapes. 45 million people are playing this game. And probably because it's free. Yeah. So you can click the link in the description and download the game for free. Mm -hmm. Lesbians, obsessed with free stuff. 100% I'll take anything hey, as free. long as it's free yeah because it's best fiend's birthday they're having um new challenges and you can get rewards like new skins um like Howie's birthday suit which I assume is just a naked Howie um so since I don't do a lot and I don't have friends or a girlfriend I've been playing a lot and I'm on level 32 right now so you can also, I think, play against me and try and beat me. Uh, what else are lesbians obsessed about, Sarah? Oh my god. Yeah, I know, we, I know. Like, we're so obsessed with them that we, like, I Can think I... we think they're real. I was just gonna say that. Yeah. You read my mind. I, mind reader lesbians. I was literally gonna say that you think that they are their character. Like, also, obviously, lesbians are obsessed with cats. Like, that is nothing new. Sadie, like, also likes drinking out of the tap in the bathroom yeah. sink and so I was like okay I'm gonna buy Sadie one of those water fountains those like right so it's like Continu a water continually, continually flowing continuous flow with a filter I'm like Sadie Just likes to drink I'm gonna water. buy it Sadie, Sadie hates, hates it. it she hates it Sadie wants to drink out of the tap in the bathroom that's what Sadie gets <laughs> I like seeing Lesbians walking down the streets of Toronto holding one of those like cat jungle gyms. Oh, yeah, and they're just huge I'm like that's taking up posts. half of your apartment. Yeah, you live in a city I mean you got 400 square feet. That's 200 square feet that you're like, taking home for your cat the cat jungle gym But I get you I get you girl. I'm thinking Sadie wants one of those yeah. I have seen pictures on Instagram of lesbians with their cat tattooed, tattooed. On them. Here's one thing that I get obsessed with and I think a lot of lesbians do are exes it's Like so obsessed that you will unfriend them on Facebook just to prove a point But then go into your friends Facebook so that you can creep your ex to see who she's hanging out with and if oh, yeah. she's dating I have two Facebook accounts just for that purpose. I <laughs> That's not a lie, but I don't use it. But I do have <laughs> Well, I want like, to I want to see what Jill is up to. To Adriana. To Adriana's. I and then the, so the one you don't use, you keep all the exes on it. Correct. And like I don't understand. Like we're so obsessed with our exes to the point where like we will have not like we have been broken up for 5 years yeah. and then they get a new girlfriend and you see it on Instagram and you're like Ugh. I haven't thought about her in three years, but right. I'm like, oh, what did, what does her new girlfriend do? She has the same birthday as me. <laughs> She's just trying to replace me. <laughs> also, too, with exes, yeah. is like, you never want to run into your ex, but you want to run into your ex when you know you're going to run into them. I am going to show up there and look so hot. On a daily basis, you never do your hair. You never put on makeup. No. You don't put on really clean pants. <laughs> but, but if Megan's going to be there... And you're like, oh my god, I didn't know you were going to be here. This is I so embarrassing. Threw this up. And finally, um, one of the things lesbians are obsessed about is as much as we like love fictional characters and we love TV shows and we love celebrities, mm -hmm. we also love hating people. Just turn on a dime. I know. We, we're we literally, we love you or we hate you. There's no middle. No. It's like loving or hating your ex. You're just like, yeah. I love you and now I hate you. Madly in love you. with her or like, she's just the worst person. I mean, let us know, you know what, what like, you're obsessed if with, If you're right? still watching Pillow Talk, you're obsessed with it. So, case in point. Oh, that's true. Leave a comment in the description.
with things that you're obsessed with. They yeah. can be lesbian things or they can just be things that you are personally obsessed Extremely with. Extremely obsessed with. Quickly, what are you most obsessed with? I will say what you're, you're most obsessed with. Shopping. Shopping, I think. Buying. Sarah has, no lie, 15 black t-shirts. I can't tell the difference. Oh, I'm obsessed with t-shirts. T-shirts? Yeah. You're obsessed with t-shirts. Yeah. And no one can say no to a cheap, nice t-shirt. I can. You I've had that shirt for like three years. You should probably just It has shopping. shrunk. <laughs> Look at where these arms are. I need a new one, but I'm not shopping. And I know what I'm obsessed with. You food? Have to say yes, Sarah, we all know I'm obsessed with food. Thank you again to Best Fiends for sponsoring this video. Thumbs up for lesbians being obsessed with stuff. Thank you for watching Pillow Talk Monday. We will see you next Monday. Favorite queer characters in television and film. Should we just like get into it? Because like I get into love the list. I love talking about all my favorite Lesbian characters. characters. Yes. Okay, start. Okay. Uh, in no particular order. Speak for yourself, Carol.